Where to begin? Hope. Yes. 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 You signed up to be my partner for this project, and then you never showed up to class for like a month. And I uh, ended up having to do the project myself. I used to sneak off into the back room and play one-on-one -on -one basketball with uh, balloons and a laundry basket. Get a new phone, man. That thing doesn't even accept picture messages. The one time you were at Weir Parkwood Bowl, you pounded that 40 and then threw up right afterward. We played with uh, wrestling toys in his backpack. The fact that you also have the same Avon lotion that I use, I knew you have impeccable taste, brother. And that towel, he had a Hawaiian towel, and it came up to here on him, and he wrapped it around. <laughs> Me and Mike Chan doing the big kahuna move on him. We continued to play one on one basketball um, on a non existent hoop. It was just a black piece of metal that used to hold up the, the basketball hoop. That, that time that we, we raced in the 40 yard dash, and it gave you a five yard head start. And, I still beat you by five yards, I think. In between the two days, you were the first guy to say, you want to come hang out at my house, man. You can, you can hang out here in between practices. And that was a great time. I remember that. I'll never forget it. Pin everything out because who the hell knows where Chris was. And I just hear, and I look on the ground, and Chris is doing snow angels on the ground with the microphone on his back. Ah. You know, at times, his represented, you know, the, the likes of, of being my little brother, although he is much bigger than me and would always let me, you know, uh, bully him around when he knew all too well that he could destroy me um, with one hand. I think you're probably the only commissioner of a league to be so bad at fantasy football. Um, yeah, just to remind you, I'm, I'm going to spin you around real quick here. If you look right here, I don't know if you can see that, but it says CK de God. That's, that's you. Welcome to the club. Um, although, um, you know, you should be very happy that, that you still have your boyish good looks, all of your hair. Um, can't all say the same. We're, uh, we're gonna be some old ass men. Ain't nothing like being 30 and just seeing all your body give out on you. I'll just give you two pieces of advice uh, now that you're, uh, you know, getting on in age. One, I recommend bending now from the knees and not the waist. You bend at the waist and farts just tend to slip out. Uh, make sure you get those eyebrows trimmed up, but just not too close. Just in case she screws up again and you look like a drag queen. Uh, number two, stop rooting for the Lakers. They're terrible. Just get on that Clippers bandwagon, man. You really owe it to yourself. Sorry, the Lakers are going to suck this year. If you're going to a Clippers fan, no. I got an idea. For your birthday, buy yourself a new phone. <laughs> Um, but, but seriously, bud, uh, I want to wish you a very happy birthday. Man, happy birthday. CK, happy 30th birthday. Happy birthday, Chris. Chris, I just wanted to say happy 30th birthday, buddy. Happy birthday, Chris. Chris, I just want to wish you a happy 30th birthday. Happy 30th birthday, Chris. I want to say uh, happy 30th birthday. Happy birthday, Chris. But, uh, happy birthday and uh, hope you have fun. Hey, Tank, why don't you wish Chris a happy birthday? Hey, what's up, Chris? It's my birthday. Happy birthday, it's dude! Birthday. Hey, it's it's take care, birthday. man. Happy birthday, guys. Cause it's my birthday. Cause it's my birthday. Cause it's my birthday. Cause it's my birthday.